for our next presenter uh, he most of our pr team is she and this guy is an amazing guy amazing pr matters and he is the head of sales and marketing for uh, air tech in bahrain current area 34 director and he was the current year and the past year cgd design designer for the cgd team also he is serving as brand consultant this year uh, with dtm arij uh, please help me welcome toastmaster taufik abdul khad toastmaster taufik the screen is yours thank you master of ceremony toastmaster mohammad shiraz you are doing wonderful job and to the team of pr for awards toastmaster suraya that was excellent and it gives an exciting moment for all the brand ambassadors in here thank you so much you did a lovely job and bravo to you and the entire pr team who are some of them are here with us some of them are busy due to their other commitments but i'm sure they whenever they are watching us and the uh, recordings they some of them have requested personally dtm arij i suppose you're taking the note of that and they have asked for recording and to be shared so it will be on our youtube channel very soon hopefully with our social media team i got a yes note so thank you so much for that dtm ali shabaz thank you for joining in i know you have a busy schedule but you are actively listening today so that's makes us very excited with blah 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 award thank you so much yeah lots of heart and lots of love to you dtm ali shabaz and all the dignitaries in the house district director the immediate past district director division directors area directors all the club officers i can see you there wide lovely with your smiles and you are excited for those awards and we are excited to give them out to you without further ado let me share the screen today we have the branding workshop when we say we are going to give awards it's important as well to make sure that the, you are brand compliant now brand compliant is very simple very easy keep things very simple what is all branding about branding is something it's a process of creating an identity for any company it could be an apple it could be a samsung it could be you name it mercedes benz then you have the audi you if you go for vehicles so all of them are brand compliant when you see those logos would be similar so all we talking about branding is something of a logo which is visual it's a design it's a mission and the tone of voice what are we trying to comply here what are we trying to share what is all branding about it's compliant compliant means you will see everywhere it's the same logo it's the same size it's the same shape it's the same tone so you don't change those you keep them as it is that's all branding about and when you do that you get an award and what more a recognition you attract more members with you you can see on the screen now the toastmasters logo it is available don't go and do the google search what people usually tend to do is you go to google and you say i need a logo don't do that you have toastmasters website it is available there's a logo there you can just simply download whatever portfolio that you need to stick on it's just copy it paste it and it's simple it could be in full color it could be in gray scale it could be white you name it you get it it's all on toastmasters website and it's easy to access www.toastmasters.org and you get what you need no, don't blah, go blah. Blah. blah 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 no You want to do blah blah blah? Okay. No. Look at the blah 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 website. If you do no, no. that, <laughs> Diti Maris, you can just walk in any time. You are the boss. So I, I'm looking at you. Don't go to the blah 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 site. You can go to the toastmasters.org, and everything is available. Very simple. And we also had the kit. I think uh, Diti Maris, you have the link for it, right? You will be sharing it. The kit to empower for VPPRs. so that would be also awesome now when we talk about logo what important is in the logo toastmasters logo we say that the size and the shape should be similar don't change those 
don't magnify, don't modify, don't minimize, don't maximize. You can do the sizing based on what it is. And it will give you the same. Don't lock the version. When you have to reduce it, don't go and reduce, shrink it from somewhere and the shape looks completely different. That's what is logo about. And the clear space, if you see on, on your screen right now, there's an XX mark next to it. This X represents that you need to give an equal space. That is called a breathing space. So allow those breathing space and your brand compliant. When we say about minimum size, you have 72 pixel web. If you're doing it in Canva, you can very much do that. Just put the number 72 and you can get it. If you're doing on PowerPoint, just make sure that you are not shrinking the logo itself, just resizing it to an extent where you can play around wherever you want to fix it, but don't re-modify. And another version of print is three by fourth. When you do that in the resizing, you will definitely get it. Now there are two types of logo, what we see. One we see is like a globe and the other one is logo with the word. Now logo with the word, don't change the colors. These are brand colors, stick to the same. They are the royal blue and the maroon. Don't change them, they, are have, to, they have to be the same way. And don't add the tagline to it. Mostly what we see in the PR, what we get for submissions is we have with the tagline. There are no taglines with this because it's a word mark. This is how they want it. It was earlier, yes, but no more in the new version. So please do follow the new version, the brand manual is your best guideline and it gives you full detail version. So ensure that you comply with the same. Now, again, there are three versions. You have the full color. If in case you are having some different colors, you can use the black version as well. And you have white version as well. So wherever you're using, you can use those colors, but make sure they are having equal amount of reading space as mentioned here, the XXX, not blah, blah, blah. So you concentrate on those breathing space and you will be fine. And again, when you have a reduced version, you follow the pixels, which is the size 72 and three by four. We have a question and answer session, Toastmasters Dinesh, so you can be relaxed. You will be given ample time to ask the same, unless you find somewhere that am I, am I not audible or not visible, or my screen is not visible, then you can stop me. Toastmasters logo lockups. When we talk about logo lockups, you see they come with the website. They come with the tagline where leaders are made. They come up with uh, the since 1924 from when the Toastmasters was, the brand was launched. So you have all those lockups. Those have to be as it is. They cannot be modified or altered. Yes, the colors, you can play around. You have different colors available on the website. You can choose them and you can organize in your designs according to that. But don't alter them. And again, you need a breathing space. Don't type in your own clubs because that is not what is permitted. There are certain permissions, but those will be advised to you according to that. Now here you see the logos. When I said don't change those logos, you are changing the curve of the logo. If you see, it is not aligned, it is twisted. So this is not allowed. The logos perspective is very important. Don't disappropriate because this is what happens when you try to proportion to something and you scale it and it goes out of your scale and then it looks something different. Don't add because you have the lockup and then you have the globe. These are not permitted. But Marie, that's you not to... The one in the middle down in the bottom, it's, it looks fine. Why? Why not? And the one in the middle and the top. Why not? Which one is the middle? This one or this one? Both. Why not using it? Yeah, what is wrong I, with that? I, I think DTM Ari just giving a permission, so you can put with these versions. No, no, no I'm it. asking a question, so you will tell why. <laughs> why this is wrong? Because if you go back to... 
we go back to this, you know, if, even if you put District 20 here, uh, Division C Director, I can see a lot of interesting questions coming from in you. If, even if you put District 20, it is not permitted because it's yeah. it's a part of the lo locker version. The locker version says what? Yes. Any volunteers? You can unmute no, and say, what the locker International. <laughs> yes. So does it say Toastmasters International in here? No. <laughs> okay, here it says Toastmasters International. So what is the problem? Exactly. What's the problem? Can someone tell? Logo has been stretched. Yes. It, it, it is not it is, round. It has been stretched off. If you see here, it is giving ample space. It is giving a version which is by itself default. It is not circular because you have the written version in between. But here it's stretched off. The globe is not the globe any longer. And we can't have that. So it's very important. And you don't play with the colors because you have enough colors available. Don't change them. They say, oh, this is maroon. This is fine. This is the Toastmasters brand color. No, it does not work that way because you have grayscale, you have white, you have the full color, but you don't have the maroon. So why, why do you play around and get a maroon? Because this is not brand color. So it's important that we stick to the colors. Don't alter them. Don't put the logo on the colors that are not brand compliant. That will be explained by DTM Arish shortly. What are color palettes? Because color palettes are equally important. You don't place it anywhere. Even if you have District 20 here, it does not work because it has. it's supposed to have the Toastmasters International wording on it. You can't create with the tagline and put in where leaders are made. Oh, this is the uh, Toastmasters tagline. No, you can't because you have to use what is available on Toastmasters website. That's why I said, don't Google up. Don't but maybe go... I want to put my club name on, uh, on the round, like around the logo. Why not? <laughs> then you're violating the first, <laughs> first rule. So no you're name right. around yes. the logo. <laughs> Where is the clear space? <clears throat> Perfect. No, no, no name around the logo, but you can have the your name besides it, giving the space, the breathing space, you can have your name. You can have with the size that you wish. Don't try to glow it. I have seen posters, people trying to glow it. Oh, we are trying to glow the logo. We are trying to make it more visible. You're not trying to make it more visible. You're spoiling the brand name. You're spo spoiling the brand identity. That's very important. So don't change the colors. Don't create additional names or district names within those. Nothing to do with the logo. Logo is a very sensitive part and it is actually trademark. So don't change it. It is recognized and it is registered. So please use those legacy to your advantage. Don't change any element of the logo. If you see the globe is how it is supposed to be and how it is here, you'll say, oh, this is transparency. No, you can't change. Everything is very sensitive. Now somebody asked me, why can't we put District 20? So can we put District 20 in here? Yes, in the bottom. Right? I don't hear anybody <laughs> from the volunteers. Can we? Yes. <laughs> I don't have so what, dif what, what difference is here and here? Why, how can we put here District uh, 20? Why is it allowed? You have breathing space behind. Breathing space. Right. Very good. You have the breathing space and this is not a locked up version. So you can put your District 20. But can we put my club name? Can I put BITP in here in place of, Bari, uh, in place of District 99? Anyone? I can yes. put anything yes. I write. Yes. I can even put a tag or slogan for my club, right? Mm -hmm. Not with the logo. <laughs> Not with the below logo. It, below it. Yeah. If you give the breathing space, yes, you can. But not with the logo. It cannot be a locked up version. It cannot be a locked up version. The brand 
office itself of TI, I raised the question and they clearly mentioned that you cannot go with the lockup version. Lockup version stays as it is. And if you give a breathing space, then you can put the brand compliant colors and you can put your wordings, including the tagline. Itia Maric. Oh. Here, here is something for all of you. Can you tell me what post, what logo from these are, uh, are like acceptable? Which one from those posters are acceptable? None of them. None of. Why? But why? I want to hear from you. The one in the middle, it's really nice. Right? Can we use any of those? No. No. no, thank you so much. Do not make your own logo. Do not, uh, like, I don't want to keep saying don't, 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 but this is something we need to follow because this is not Toastmasters international identity. This is our identity as well. We are the member of this organization and we want it to be done in a right way, in the best way ever. And we want to save this identity. So this logo, all of it, no, no, no. Don't cut the edges, don't shrink, don't put the transparent, don't invent a logo for you. Just save and reserve our identity. Because this is us, Toastmasters is us. So do you want someone to ruin us? <laughs> okay. If there is a question, can I add something to that, if possible? Sure. <laughs> I've uh, I've seen quite a lot on forums, people asking, why can't we have our own logos? Like, we want to stand out. We I, want I, to, you yeah. know, show our club. Yes. Wait, wait. No, because I have, I have something for that later, but that's okay. Oh, go okay. ahead. No, go ahead, go ahead. Uh, I've seen this a lot. It's a concern many, many clubs have raised. But there's a reason why we don't allow clubs to have their own club logo or to make this logo their own or whatnot. We're all part of one organization, but at the same time, it's a way to almost kind of level the playing field, right? Some clubs are huge. They have 75, 80 members. I've seen clubs with over 100 members. Some clubs are small but it doesn't ruin the quality of the club, right? So when we use, when we all use the same logo, what we're saying is, come have a look at our club and see if it fits you, right? So we have to be supportive of each other as clubs while also supporting our clubs in our own way, but not trying to topple one another, if that makes sense. Uh, but that's just my perspective. I don't know if this, uh, I don't know if TI has given any reason. Thank you, Toastmaster Suraya. Thank you, Toastmaster Tofi. What do you have next? Shall I go? Ahead or? Yes, please. The color palettes. Okay. So, so many is like asking about the coloring and the colors, how to use it, what to use. So, Toastmaster provided us with the colors and these are the branding colors okay and so many people was telling me like we have used this uh, when we are creating the poster we saw your poster in the district and uh, for, from the gradient part in the bottom and by this what they call it um, uh, the drop thing or what is it color in english picker. huh color picker too. color picker we used it and we went to your gradient part and we took the number from there and we used it that is not applicable the numbers are there from the manual it's available and you can copy paste you can take screenshot actually and save it and i've seen one video from dtm kajitan before where i, I love this idea oh my god uh, he has print out all the colors codes everything in one paper and he's keeping it in front of him uh, whenever he want to use he has the codes in front of him and this was amazing idea so the primary colors are there the maroon blue and gray of course white color as well and black 
but preferable not to use black as primary color for like backgrounds or something you can use it as for the fonts or or that's uh, like in fonts but not as um, background or main color so the numbers for all the uh, colors is here and it's available also in the brand manual we have also the ascent color which is like only to highlight specific things or or to make like um, if you want to make people to notice something you can use the yellow this happy yellow color and also the number is there but it should not be a primary color you should not make your whole poster with this color or like uh, uh, it shouldn't be the big thing in the in the poster I've seen so many posters with with the uh, happy yellow color and it was all of it it looks nice but this is not brand compliant so the primary colors is those three colors four uh, five colors with the black and white and the essence color is the happy yellow so we can move to the next slide yes and this is the gradient if you will see and use this color picker and just to click in any place it will not give you the exact numbers that toastmaster provided this is how you need to use the gradient it's either from both sides you put the dark color and in the middle the light one or in from top to down uh, to bottom or like uh, same exactly how it is shows in here you can also find this in the brand manual and you can keep it uh, you can uh, take a screenshot if you wish but it is there available in the brand manual you can go for it you can check the numbers whenever you want to use it and you can use it anytime also it's there for the maroon and here is the numbers for it and it is there also for the gray but what if i want to let's say for example use the uh, uh, blue with the gray with the maroon together what do you think Sh can i use that like i have it here like right i have the gradient and i want to put the three colors i want to put all the three colors what do you think is it acceptable is it allowed someone can tell me if this is allowed no yes no yes no yes who said yes yes Why yes so? we can use the three colors together okay yes. unfortunately no it is not allowed the gradient is as it shows right now either gray with the other gray color other shade from the gray color uh, we have the cool color and fray, uh, fair uh, gray and for the maroon we have the deep maroon and the rich maroon and for the blue we have the loyal blue and what is it blissful i cannot read the blissful blue yes so this these are the gradient colors we cannot mix the colors we cannot put oh but like it's a gradient no we need to follow these instructions let's move on we can also use the transparent someone was telling me how you can use a pink color no we cannot use a pink color if you see here and if you read carefully transparency it should be used in this specific way if you have a gradient maroon uh, for example a gradient par maroon picture or or like um, what they call it shape i can put a white color or white shape on top of it and make the tra transparent tra ah, make it transparent 70 percent in this way it will give this color then this is brand compliant but if you will use the on only the maroon by itself and put the white color and make it transparent it won't uh, work it needs to be gradient if you can read here it shows maroon gradient blue gradient or the cool gray color on top of it there is the blue the loyal blue with 70 percent transparency this is the only way how you can get the, these other colors which is part of the branding only by using this transparency don't use the maroon color and the transfer uh, make it a transparent behind there is a photo this is not brand compliant okay what about these colors I love this yellow and this like it's Valentine theme. <laughs> Valentine is soon to be to come, right? Yes, wrong. No, no. You but the first one is blue. 
No. 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 No for all these colors. Someone was asking before, convention are using purple and things. Come on. Convention. Let them use whatever. <laughs> I mean, for the events, for the big events, the like the international convention, they have like uh, a specific approvals receiving from the TMI for using only for them, only for the convention, these colors. We will not use the same colors just because the convention used it. No. Is it there in the brand manual? It's not. So we are not allowed to use it. If there is any question related to the colors and anything else, we can discuss it later. <laughs> I have a question for you. Like yeah. For, for DTAC. Can yes. you use these colors? For DTAC? Did you take approval from TMI? You took approval. No, you no, have no. the email. Okay. If you want to take, if you let's say, okay, okay, let's let's do something. I, I want to use the orange. I love the orange. I am a person who love orange color. Okay. I love eat orange. I love do anything with orange. Fine. So I want to use it in my posters for DTAC. It's a special event, right? Send email to, uh, to brand uh, Toastmaster International brand team. If they give you approval, save this email and whenever come someone or me, I will come to you questioning you, put the email in my face and tell me I get approval. I will be quiet. I will not say anything. Take approval if they will give you. <laughs> but I'm not sure they, uh, it's not, I am sure it is not allowed. And if they will give you, maybe they will have as exceptions, although I don't think so. Uh, if you have a question, Tofi, we can, uh, Faru, uh, Tasmasa Farooq, we can take it later. If you want to add something, it's okay. Yeah, no, just adding to a point. What if I have a uniform for all DTAC people to wear an orange shirt and we have our photos with orange shirts? Is that acceptable? <laughs> ah, uh, Tasmasa Tofi, I think for appearance, like, I mean, <laughs> Do you have an answer to Master Sophie? They have a team. I, I, I don't think so. There's any issue with that. It's a I, tough question. <laughs> <laughs> no, see, I, what I, I know. know. Just, just having fun. So no, I, I just want no. to be clear that photos, are not, photos can be put in any color. Actual photos of people. That's okay. But you have to really look at the theme of the meeting and do that. Well, I can tell you something re related, to, like to give you a fair answer for this. If you are intentionally putting the Toastmaster uh, logo on that orange shirt you are using and you want to show it in the picture in a group photo, so better not to use an other than brand compliant uh, colors. Because if you are just putting it for fun without having the Toastmasters marketing materials, do whatever you want. I hope that this is was fair enough. If you are like doing it in purpose of marketing for Toastmasters, so this will not work. If you're doing it just for fun, for you, for the club, for the event, it's okay. I guess, don't say later, Arish said. <laughs> yeah, Arish, I see, yeah. I see different kind of logo in here. We had only two logos, which was Toastmasters International and both written as well as the globe. What is this? This is the Bathways logo. The Bathways logo. And actually, we don't use it. Unless if we want, for example, to uh, recognize a member's achievements in for Bathway or having something related to Bathway, a workshop related to Bathway, and we want to show it, we can use this logo. But we cannot replace the Toastmasters logo and use the Pathway logo. Right, Tofi? Yes, please. Can I use this in our poster and submit you for PR award? For what? PR award. Is it like the PR award uh, you mean? Okay, if I'm delivering a speech personally, let's say the first award, M1. Okay, I'm delivering a speech and it's about something like I'm achieving or finishing a level in pathway, I can use it, but I don't want it to be the main thing. 
It shouldn't be the main thing. Like, don't replace the Toastmaster logo to use this. And what about the breathing space in here? Can I shrink it? No, the details are there as it shows here. You have a breathing space as it is shown. And to, if you want to minim minimize it or make it smaller, you have a specific uh, inches and pixels. For the web, it shows how many pixels, 72. And for the print, it should be not minimized more than one inch. Huge. I, I now members a lot of members are completing and finishing their levels. So how do I appreciate them? You can use again the pathways badges in the poster. Like I used it, I used those badges before, but I was actually taking the real photo of the pen. When I'm reading the brand manuals now, I've seen that these are the allowed badges to be used. Don't take the poster or uh, a picture of the pin. You have the logo itself or the badge uh, for each, uh, uh, what they call it, pathway. So I can have it next to the member name, like this member achieved this uh, pathway. And if you don't want to use it, it's okay as well. Tofi, you're asking me questions. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yes. Because members are asking, you know, they want to put on their member recognition. You can, you can use, you can use these ones, and you can find it from the Toastmasters website. Anytime you can see what is all the allowed badges to be used from the brand manuals. And not from Google. Don't Google it. Don't Google it. Go to Toastmasters website. Go to the resources. From there, you will have the brand portal and under the brand po portal you will find the logos the images that can be used all the resources you want to have for your posters and also toastmaster suraya she shared something on our youtube channel we did a workshop completely on canva where all the links are available we will reshare those same again with a kit to empower our vpprs so you will have all the kit available to you at your disposal. You can select those, you can have those gradients, you can have those colors, it'll make life easier for you. Don't alter them, don't change them, and you can go with it. Again, oh, something fine. to play with, fonts. Fonts, you know, th this is something very tricky. People use the same font, but they manipulate the font with you, you glowing it off, with shrinking it then, and giving the space and they think this is brand compliant we use the same font so dj marich so the toastmasters allows for us to use the gotham uh, font type and there is a free alternative because i know in canva or other uh, places like the gotham is by uh, not free so there is a free alternative to the gotham only like if you can see the Gotham, you can, uh, the free alternative for it is the Mont Montserrat. Anyway, I don't know how to read it. Okay. And this is, will be used for the headline and subheads. Like don't have the content of your speech or the body of your, uh, sorry, poster with the Gotham. This is something actually, to be honest, I, I just knew it. Okay. It needs to have the, uh, for the headline and subline to use the Gotham. And these are the font example. And if you can see, for example, the Gotham, it doesn't have italic. Like, you know, the italic, uh, not straight line. It's like, like the one I'm using here, <laughs> the font type. It shouldn't use, it should not be used this way. It should be only used based on these, um, I'm, 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 saying, I'm putting with my hand as if you are seeing my hand <laughs> where I'm pointing. So this is the examples only for the Gotham and the Monstrate will have the similar appearance as, as Gotham and, and, and it can be used for free if you are not able to have the Gotham one. Also we have the MyRide Pro, also we can use it and it's used for the body copy of collateral okay for your poster not the headlines or subheads only and also for the my right pro there is an a free alternative which is source sense pro these are the uh, fonts that needs to be used let's go to the next page 
What about this, uh, ya Taufiq? Why, yani, I want to have a Halloween theme and I want to use the first one. Why not? <laughs> Can I use this one or any of those? Maybe Division C director Dosna Safarook, he will like. <laughs> yes, you can have it printed on your t-shirt and take a photo for that one. <laughs> Without the Toastmasters logo, yes. Yes. <laughs> well, this There is always a loophole. <laughs> <laughs> we cannot use any fonts from our head. We can use only the Gotham and its alternative and the Myrad Pro with its alternative. Okay? Okay. No, this images. is the big issue, yeah. Big issue, yeah. Yatofi. We talk about images. Oh and my God. People, people, love to, people love to Google it up and pick images and post it. And say, yes, this is about the meeting. You know, just meeting happened and we took the pictures. Okay, but how? You took a copyrighted picture <clears throat> from Google and you pasted on your poster. Anything which is copyrighted is not allowed because they pay money. And I, I'm sure Toastmaster Farooq, he can give us more input on that. You have now kind of, if you take images, you get also some cents and some dollars for taking that NFC, I think. Absolutely. And you don't want to get into that trouble because there could be a legal case against you also. Yes, but please avoid those. You have the brand resources, you have also, a lot of photographs in case you don't want to pick from your meeting. You can pick from those links and you can easily share in your posters. And you will have case. professional images. Yeah. Yes, go ahead. Professional images of meetings and everything available on Toastmasters website. So why do you take a risk? But what if I make um, a meeting and my theme is like balloons and I want to have my poster shows a lot of balloons. I will bring you the colors, branding colors, balloons. Why I don't use it? You have Toastmasters balloons, by the way, for special. Yeah, we balloons. have. Ah, I picked the wrong uh, theme. <laughs> you can use those. Somebody asked me, can we use chocolates? Ah. <laughs> what do you think, Kemarich? Can we? I don't want to answer this question. <laughs> no, of course we shouldn't. We can use an, a professional image either from Toastmaster website if it can uh, speak about your theme. If not, then better not to have something not related to Toastmasters. What about Maybe before we move to the next one? What about the icons? Icons, Toastmaster Tafi. Can I put icons like a uh, calendar icon? As long as it's looking like a shape, it's fine. But don't try to overdo it because then we are getting into a gray zone. Yes, actually, but icons is better not to be used because it's a questioning. There will be a lot of questions. It's not not uh, it's not uh, that it's not allowed but better not to use it like if you will say the time is this this uh, we will understand no need to have the calendar yani. <laughs> so um, yes tell us about this logo 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 to be placed on the photographs yes so what do you think we can have like the one in the bottom with a green like picture and photo and then we add the post uh, the logo on top of it this is actually no because when you do that you cannot see the logo if you can see the one here with the uh, black shirt in behind or in the in the picture we can see the logo it's obvious we can read it we can understand it but the other photo it's not possible to be seen so it's better to have something uh, like one color behind the logo and it's much preferably to be on top of the branding colors not even on the photo <laughs> but what about this can we use the logo this way never know <laughs> never know <laughs> so yes never <laughs> No, none of these are allowed because we cannot see, like, we cannot use half of the logo. 
we cannot uh, use it on top of so many even if these lines maybe it's up, uh, used by Toastmasters but we should not use it like this again one color behind it and it should be or preferably to be uh, on top of uh, uh, on top of the what they call it uh, branding colors all questions will be answered later if not today we will answer it later now I want to ask you this big questions can who is the first one who can tell me one only one of these uh, logos it's for what someone open your mic and answer the one in orange McDonald's. the one in orange McDonald's, McDonald's. McDonald's. okay the this uh, black one apple. 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 Hmm. apple okay the red one who's hungry KFC. 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 and the green one Starbucks. 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 I have a big question for all of you and the great that you all know what is those logos for whom do you see for example in Kuwait we are in Kuwait or in Bahrain do you see Starbucks Salmiya or like a logo specifically for Starbucks Salmiya and another one for Mishrif or Ermethia or another places branches do you see something like that no kfc no, kfc no. do you see the logo for kfc is different from kuwait and usa and bahrain and or it's all the same all the same all the same apple mcdonald's other than bm all these other logos do you see it same or different internationally the same same so why can you move to the next screen why we can't save our identity Should do you think same. kfc kfc is better than toastmasters yeah it will fill your stomach kfc but it will not fill our mind do you think starbucks or mcdonald's or uh, ferrari are they all better than us so let's make our value our identity shown to all let's not play with the branding with our logo and let's reserve it let's work all of us to make this uh, like something is is important to us and to everyone else thank you so much back to you Taufi. or there are some questions i think uh, toastmaster edition has raised okay we will have only like five minutes for the questions and toastmaster shiraz can help us yeah. Uh, yes. Can I speak? Who's that? Yes, Dushan. Yes, Dushan, you can continue. Yeah, there, see that uh, I have few questions regarding the branding guidelines. The first thing we start this uh, district efforts to encourage the creativity of the members. Remember, these all are the paid members from themselves. Toastmaster International not going to pay us for any of these things. That's the point number one. When this will uh, go through last few years, this branding guidelines push us more and more and more. We need to re remember VP, PR, PRs in the clubs are not the super duper designs, designers. And the next thing, we all have jobs and we all have families. This is the volunteer thing. I think Toastmaster International is more concerned to use the branding guidelines into the district and the international level. <laughs> Let the clubs to do the creativity. Can I, can I no, answer? Let me finish it. Okay. I didn't think no one in the outside to come to the clubs because of the, see the branding guidelines, because of we are using the branding guidelines, the people will uh, join to the meeting. That's the question number one. Question number two. If the, we put all those effects and the, this district award only going to be the ribbon, that's the second question. I think these awards need to be valued. At least the 20 to $50 uh, voucher that we can purchase on the Toastmaster International website. The badges and a lot of things are there. Now, these days, the things have been so expensive and Toastmaster International need to help. That's the biggest thing. If last 10 years, do you evaluation regarding the clubs and the members in Bahrain? You have the numbers, but the, the, the lines are more that the big clubs also, they didn't find the members. 
that second question third question but this is the most important one this is the one i asked from the daniel rex why toastmaster international not spend for the social media do you ever saw the youtube advertisement for the toastmaster international you can see the tedx are there master class are there all are there just toastmaster international not spend the fill to promote the brand but they force us to do the everything remember the next the final thing this is our money we paid to the toastmaster we did everything to promote the toastmasters on top of that they are now in the creativity of the members and putting the branding guidelines i think we need to raise our voice uh, there are the senior members here from the district 20 and i think alisha pash also is here as the uh, regional advisor this this part need to take to the toastmasters international our money need to be worth because we cannot put lot of effect now it is very difficult to bring the members to the club because the competition is huge i can i we, give you we, my answer yeah go ahead it's done my question is done thank you so much if we will take this as your point of view then when i will go to kfc order my plate okay. no let me let me finish let me finish let me finish wait wait i listen just, to you till the end let me just me the, ask just give me the second to give you the answer those are the brand those are the marketing brand can i they can say, i i listen say to you that day. Day. okay uh, see because we have another Arabic. workshop for the arabic one Arabic. 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 give me a, give, give me a second I work for If the you are ready the time, because we have yeah. other questions, we have another workshop in Arabic. Wallah, I swear. Just as I listen to you, just listen your, to me to the Arabic, end. No, no. Give me a second. Your counter is wrong. You cannot cannot compare the KFC and the Toastmasters. Exactly. Toastmasters not exactly. For that. No. No, 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 this is the thing That's that you don't record. know, my dear, this is, th what you have just said, it shows to me that you don't know, that the identity of Toastmasters, they paid for it to reserve it, it okay. is reserved, it's something they paid money for it, okay. to have this logo, to have this manual, with all the details, with all the things that they added, they are not taking out uh, please let me continue they are not taking out your creativity they are just telling you simple as when you want to deliver a speech you have your uh, speech uh, what they call it objectives they are not asking you what to say but how to say it and you are following the objectives the same way for the branding or for the posters you have the uh, the Uh, what they call it, the criteria for how to use the branding do all the creativity they are only asking from you to reserve their identity because they paid money for it so who are we to go and play with the identity of Toastmasters they are not taking out your creativity they want you to be creative but at the same time they want you also to be part of saving the identity of Toastmasters which they paid money for it and which you were part of paying this money to save the identity when you are renewing your membership if you want to go against and do the violation of their rules then why you keep paying for it uh, we okay. are the one who are reserving it right thank you thank you very much Malik. because of the timing uh, uh friends will go for the A quick question from Damodaran. Can you please ask uh, ask your question quickly? Uh, it's not about the question. I would like to share one common mistake. What we do in Canva when we are yes. making the flyer, the default font of the uh, Canva is uh, like Open Sans Extra Bold. Then, so I made all my posters, and then I thought it is Source Sans Pro, but it is Open Sans Pro. It is similar to Source Sans Pro. So we have to make sure that our font is like Montserrat or So Sans Pro. So I fell for that. So it is just a suggestion. Taufik, do you have any, any comments on that? No, thank you very much for sharing Toastmasters and Damodaran. Yes, you're right. People do mistake and they just put Sans Pro and they don't see what is in front or behind. So we have to make sure when we do it, 
And now Canva is very simple. You can add those templates. And of course, DTM Arij will share it in our group, EPPR group. We have the group ready. Toastmaster Soraya will also share the link of YouTube. Uh, once again, she's raising her hand. So thank you so much, Toastmaster Soraya. And our District 20 website is there. Please do refer to the websites and you will get updated. Toastmaster International website is also always updating with latest features. And we hope new uh, measures and new ways of exciting our members and prospective members. So we can always be creative within our boundaries. We have it well defined. And my brother, he posted that Toastmasters does not create YouTube channels and YouTube videos. You're wrong, my brother. Please go to the Toastmasters website and you will see there are a lot of advertisements and they've taken a lot of effort in doing so. So you can please go and refer and refresh your memory. And we are here as a PR team to guide you to the best of abilities. Please reach out to us. We will share with you the template. You don't need to waste time. We have a kit to empower our members of VPPR. It's very easy. You can make your posters, flyers, and meeting schedules and post them, including the agenda as well. So please use at your disposable and you will be excellent VPPRs. You are the brand ambassadors. So please keep rocking and all the very best. And over to you, Master of Ceremony. Um, Toastmasters, thank you very much, uh, Toastmasters Taufik. I'll, I'll 